I'm Yoshihiro Narisawa. I arrived in San Francisco yesterday from Tokyo. Uh, what images do you have about Tokyo? Have you been to Tokyo? Uh, are there many people and uh, light? So sushi, tempura, and anime, and uh, or fashion. So. Uh, Tokyo is full of many kinds of things. I love Tokyo, Japan. Tokyo is a mixture of modern, high building, and green. By the way, I'm chef. And uh, I cook in my kitchen every day. My restaurant is in the center of Tokyo. Uh, I receive safe and healthy ingredients directly from wonderful producers from all over Japan. When my restaurant is closed, I go to the mountains, forests, and sea. I often visit the uh, producers and talk with them. I love Tokyo, I love Japan, but I'm a bit worried. Tokyo and the countryside of Japan are totally different. Which do you think is a real Japan? Of course, both are the Japan that I love. It's very comfortable to live in Japan, Tokyo, but it makes me worried. Sometimes we get too comfortable. Do you know what I mean? I go to the countryside and talk with older men and women there. I learn many things from those lifestyle. Taking care of things, no waste. No throwing away things. They even use the eggshells and remaining vegetables as fertilizers. The rest of the dinner is cooked for breakfast in different and beautiful ways. This is the beauty of Japan. And it is the fantastic Japanese original life, clean, speedy, and convenient life. Two different aspects of Japan. I think the fusion of those two aspects makes Japan more special. Of course, the good part of them. As a chef, I'd like to send this message to people through my dishes. Of course, cooking tasty food. Everyone like yummy food, right? <laughs> you want to be healthy, right? You want to live long, right? Of course. I'm happy with my job because I can use fantastic ingredients to cook delicious dishes. I'm sure you love your country. Each country has many good ideas, sides, the countryside and the city side. I hope that chefs continue sending good, tasty, and happy message by mixing traditional cultures in today's society for future. Thank you.